I'm a fucking throw up. How about that? Hi everybody, my name's Austin Nova and welcome to probably the last uh, episode of this Would You Rather series. Now what I've decided to do with this last one is I'm, I just combined, I basically took everything from the previous episodes from the fiery jelly beans all the way to the uh, black tooth grin and whatnot. It's all here with a little bit of a bonus at the end. I mean, it, but we'll wait till we get there. I'm going to try to knock out the harder stuff out of the way first. I'm not going to do it in any particular order, but I want to get like the black tooth grin and stuff and all that handled first. But we're going to see how this goes. I have a feeling a mixture of, of this liquor and shots of hot sauce and lemon juice is not going to go too well. But anyway, that's the whole fun part, right? Is not knowing what's going to happen. Anyway, let's jump right into it. Would you rather run 26 miles or swim 5 miles? Uh, well, if I swim 5 miles, I mean, I don't, for one, I mean, I like to swim and I like to run, but at least with running, if I get winded or something, I'll just pass out or whatnot, but swimming, there's the risk of drowning, and I do not want to drown. That's like my worst fear. Anyway, there is a life and death situation for certain. Like, drowning is a fact, a factor. Anyway, to answer the question, I would rather run 26 miles. All right, 50-50. Doesn't matter because I'm going to be taking... Uh, actually, let's start with the heavy hitter right here, the black tooth, the black tooth grin. Anyway, oh, <gasps> oh! Glad I got that one out of the way. That's a big ass shot. That wasn't even really a shot. Would you rather be stung by twenty bees in random locations, or have each shin kicked hard? 10 times each then so a total of 20 times oh I mean eventually they would just break my fucking leg uh, I would rather be stung by 20 bees and random locations all right yeah 42 percent bring some of my uh, my cores light I had to change the beer sorry I just had to No, I'm not gonna fucking chug this. I'm gonna enjoy this out of the what I have to enjoy. If you were only allowed to read one comic book company's comic books, would you rather only read Marvel or only read DC Comics? Well, again, I've said this before, I'm sure in previous answers and stuff like that, but I've always been more of a Marvel person, so I'd rather only read Marvel. Alright, yeah. Okay, let's see. How about... Get the fucking Jägermeister going, get this shit out of the way. Because the bonus, I'm probably gonna need it for the, the little extra bit at the end. Whoa! Would you rather eat a Big Mac every six hours or eat an exquisite meal once every four days? Well, it doesn't say uh, about not eating any meals in between the fancy meals, so I would rather eat an exquisite meal once every four days. Yeah, okay. Alright, how about some fiery jelly beans? How about let's just take the rest of them? You know, just look at that. Can you see that shit? Alright. Hmm, I would probably stale because they've been sitting on my desk forever. But that's the same fucking box. Ugh. I need to wash that down with some beer. That just made it worse. Would you rather sleep on the floor wearing PJs but not, or but have no pillow, or sleep on the floor entirely naked but have one pillow? Well, cold nights can wear the PJs, warm nights can take the PJs off, use that as a pillow, and I can just use my arm as a pillow, so, kind of win with the PJs. Yeah. All right. Mmm, my favorite molasses. Oh, uh, mixing all of these together is not fun at all. Ugh. Oh, beer rinse. Ugh. Yeah. Yeah, no, not all the beer is in there. Need to fucking take the rest of that shit. 
Yeah, I had a talk hand, alright? Would you rather not be able to talk? Or not be able to walk? Well, I mean... You can still skip, and jump, and run. So, I, I guess not be able to walk. Alright. Uh, shot a lemon. Hey, lemon! Oh. Cheers, mate. You don't want to be lonely. Would you rather only date people with severe OCD or only date chain smokers? Uh, I mean, I'm already a little bit OCD. Not severe, but I am OCD, so I guess I would rather only date someone with severe OCD, I guess? Alright. Hmm. Okay, I know that one wasn't fun. Yeah, I'll make it more interesting. Hmm. Oh. 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 Why do I do that? Would you rather wear summer clothes in the winter or wear winter clothes in the summer? Well, I kind of do both of those. Um, so... However... You know... With winter, I'm mostly indoors, so I guess wear summer clothes in the winter. All right, I don't fucking know. I just, I just want to get most of this horrible shit out of the way. Cheers. Oh, oh, I forgot how bad that was. Ugh. Oh. Beer rinse. Fuck that, man. Would you rather get $20 or get frequently complimented for one day? I mean, I like compliments, but frequently complimented on every single thing? I get... That'd be pretty fucking annoying, so I would rather just get $20. I'd like to just keep my, keep my business to myself and just leave it at that. Yeah, alright. Alright, what's up next? Wasabi? You up next? There, so you can see the proof here. See that shit? Burn my nostrils for you guys. Ugh. I'm a little buzzed, so it doesn't affect me as much, but I can feel it. Feel it trying. Beer rinse. Alright, so I'm just gonna keep going until I finish this beer, and then I'll do the bonus bit. Alright? Is that cool with you guys? Too fucking bad. You can just skip to the end to see the bit if you want to. I love you. Would you rather be painted by Van Gogh or be painted by Da Vinci? Both would be an honor. But I guess I would rather be painted by Van Gogh. Plus that sounds more of like a painting name anyway. I'm drunk, alright? That's my excuse. Okay, give me a fucking break. When you see me chug that fucking big ass black tooth grin shot, and then that small bottle of Jägermeister, come on now. Would you rather be caught, or, oh wait, would you rather get caught cheating or catch your partner cheating? Uh, I mean, I've caught, I've been cheated on before. I mean, I've answered this before, but I'll answer it again just so I can finish this damn beer. But, I've been cheated on before, and it fucking sucks. Like, no one should have to go through that. There's no excuse for cheating. There's no excuse whatsoever. I do not support it whatsoever. But anyway, I don't... I wouldn't want... With my feelings of it just being wrong, I couldn't do that to somebody else, and I wouldn't want to. So, I would rather just fucking suffer through it than to cause that suffering for somebody else. So, that's my partner cheating. Cheers to no cheaters, bitch. For the rest of your life, would you rather live in a library where books are your only form of entertainment or live in a prison cell where you have access to any channel on TV? I mean, why why would I want to be in prison versus a library? I can read a lot more, I can attain a lot more knowledge, I can acquire more uh, imagination. So, plus, I, I mean, I would love that. I would really love that. I don't read as much as I should, 
and that I would want to, but I mean, I really do enjoy reading once I find something that I'm into, so I'd actually really like to live in a library as opposed to a prison cell. I mean, fuck that. Yeah. Cheers to library. Cheers to knowledge. Cheers to books. Dang school kids. Don't end up like me, alright? Would you rather eat a pine cone or eat an acorn? If squirrels can do it, so can I. I'd rather eat an acorn. That seems like it wouldn't be as much of a problem as eating a pine cone. <laughs> yeah. Cheers to acorns. Would you rather be hunted by people or hunt people? <laughs> Where? But see, here's the thing. Where's the fun in hunting people? You know, being hunted by people. I mean, talk about an adrenaline rush, right? That sounds fucked up, but I don't give a shit. <laughs> I want to be hunted. Not really. This is just this is this is just a game, guys. Not the hunting part. This fucking series. It's all for fun, all right? Nothing serious, okay? Don't take me so literal, okay? Cheers to non-literacy. Is that even a fucking word? I don't know. <clears throat> Would you rather get punched in the mouth with a mouthful of razor blades, or get punched in the mouth with a mouthful of needles? Who the fuck thinks of this shit? Uh, I mean, both would be really bad. But when I think of needles, I think of a junkie. The razor blade? That just sounds fucking badass, I guess. So I'd rather just get punched in the mouth with fucking razor blades, because, I mean, what crazy motherfucker's gonna have uh, razor blades in their mouth? <laughs> I don't give a shit. Cheers to razor blades! Would you rather be in jail for a year, or live in complete isolation in the mountains for a year? Well, I've kind of gotten used to isolation anyway, but to be in the mountains for a year, that would be lovely, as opposed to being in a jail for a year. I mean, come on, that, that should be a fucking no-brainer. To me, anyway. I would rather live in the mountains in complete isolation for a year. It's a year. I'll survive. Cheers to isolation in the mountains. Cheers to mountains. Do you rather work for Apple and know all their secrets or work for Google and know all their secrets uh, well I feel like Google has a lot more secrets and has a lot more hands-on with a lot of other people's secrets out there connected to the internet uh, so I guess rather work for Google and know all their secrets because they're gonna rule the world one day if they haven't already yeah so I'm sure there's a lot of dark secrets to go on there. Cheers! Would you rather have a jello room or have a pillow room? A jello room as in like cloudy with a chance of meatballs? Cause that would be fucking awesome. However, it might be sticky and all that stuff too. I don't know, you gotta think of the alternatives. You gotta think outside the box, okay? You can't just answer a question. Like that's, that's not fucking fun. You gotta think outside the box, man. Anyway, I guess I'd rather have a pillow room. Is that really, is that like considering like it being a padded room, like a crazy person? Because I am a crazy person, so I guess that would do me just fine. Alright, yeah, I mean, plus, if it was a jello room, I'd be eating my fucking room. Then I would have no room, man. Anyway, cheers to pillows. Would you rather have a drunk personal driver or have a thieving maid slash nanny? I don't have shit worth stealing anyway, so I'd rather have a thieving maid and nanny. At least they'd clean my shit, right? Or get rid of something that I probably wouldn't even care if it was gone. Yeah. Here's the nades and nannies. Would you rather have a one night stand or have a friend with benefits? I mean, I've never had a friend with benefits, and I've never had a one night stand. Uh. I mean, I know what they are. I think a friends with benefits, you, I mean, you would get more benefits out of that than a one night stand. But with a friend with benefits, I feel like, eh, I mean, uh, there's the possibility of it becoming more than just friend with benefits. Like you start, you might start developing feelings for that person, and then that might kind of contradict what really the two of you had planned in 
the first place, if that makes any sense. I don't know, I'm buzzed right now, having a one night stand, have a friend with benefits. But I guess, if one of the two, I guess, friends with benefits? Cheers to friends with benefits, I guess. Would you rather be tar and feathered, or be whipped and chained? Ooh, kinky. <laughs> um, tar and feathered, whipped and chained. But tar and feathered, that just sounds too messy. So I guess I'd rather be whipped and chained. I don't know. Hey, I like it rough, all right? If you were having open surgery, would you rather feel no pain but be awake to see everything happen? Or be asleep during the surgery but wake up in pain? Isn't that how surgery goes? Is that you, I mean, you're asleep during the surgery, they knock you out. They sedate you, and then when you wake up, you feel just fucking awful with the pain from the surgery? Isn't that normal? As opposed to feel no pain but be awake to see everything happens. Do you have a choice? Like, do you, are you just constantly, do you have your eyes peeled back and stuff? And you're actually seeing what's going on? Or can you look away as it's happening? Because if you can look away as it's happening, then I guess I would choose that. Um, I guess that, you know, that'd be, that might be kind of exciting. I mean, that might also be problematic because I don't know. I don't think I would handle that very well if I just see my insides being torn up stuff by doctors. Might kind of freak out a little bit, or maybe not, because I'm pretty crazy already, so, feel no pain. Yeah, I guess we all want to know the unknown, because I, I mean, anyway, cheers. Would you rather eat only salad for the rest of your life, or eat only fruits for the rest of your life? Fruit salad? Cheers! Would you rather eat Nutella or eat bacon? That's a fucking no-brainer for me. I don't like Nutella. Sorry, I just don't. I'd rather eat bacon. Yeah. Alright, well I guess that's gonna conclude this series of Would You Rather. But anyway, before we do that, let's get into this bonus bit. So, what I have here is the last dab from the show Hot Ones or the channel Hot Ones or whatever. I actually bought their, uh, I don't know, season 17 collection or whatever, hot sauces. It comes with the 10 hot sauces. But I, I bought that because I wanted to try them for myself and I've had every single one with some chicken wings because that's how I wanted to roll. But anyway, I figured with this last bit, I would eat a teaspoon of this shit. And I'm gonna fucking do that for you guys, you know why? Because I love you guys. And you guys love me, right? Right. I'm not just doing this for me, right? Okay. <laughs> it doesn't matter. I'm gonna do it anyway, because... How the fuck not? So, let's do this. And after that, I'm gonna have to retreat to the fucking kitchen for some milk or something. Alright, you see that? I just fucking dripped on the table, but with this teaspoon. I don't know if you guys can tell, but it's it it's it's there, guys. It's there. You see that? That's the teaspoon is filled with this shit. Anyway, let's get this over with. <clears throat> Ugh. You know? I don't know if I have just built my heat tolerance. Or, if it's because I'm so buzzed, I can't, my brain can't focus on the problematics going on with that heat right now. I don't know if that made any sense, I don't know. Kind of hard to make sense when you're drunk. I mean, I feel the heat starting to build up a little bit, but... Oh. I'm kind of proud of myself, though. I'm handling it a lot better than I thought I would. You know, not like that, uh, the Toe of Satan challenge, anyway. But anyway, I'm about to fall asleep, so I think I'm gonna cut it here. So I hope you guys enjoyed this series as much as I have. I am glad though that I'm kind of putting it at an end, at least for now, for a while, because I mean all this shit, 
that I'm just putting into my body. Like fucking shots of lemon and fucking black tooth grin or wasabi. Just just for entertainment, you know? It's just it's just bizarre. Like why the fuck would you do that? Why would you do that? It's not good for you. I mean, maybe in moderation it's okay, but it's not in moderation for this sake anyway. Alright, now the heat's starting to build up. So I'm gonna cut this one here, but thank you everybody so much for watching. And of course, I'll see you around in the next video. Have a good one.